Hey girl, hey! If you're new to my channel, my name is Angela, and today I have special, special stories to share with you about birthing a baby at St. Mary's Medical Center. This hospital is located in West Palm Beach, where I live, and I had a tour along with two blogger friends of mine, Heather, local mom scoop, as well as Brianna, Palm Beach moms. Brianna opened up about what it was like having her very first baby at the birthing suites at St. Mary's Medical Center. Not only that, but one of the ladies giving us the tour had all four of her children herself at the hospital. So these women shared their stories so that you could understand why this hospital is the best, I think, personally, in the entire state to have your baby. This hospital is very close to my heart. It is very special to me because I myself, with my son Cameron, when he was 12 weeks old, stayed overnight there because he had double hernia removal surgery. And when we were there, the nurses gave us top-notch quality care and the staff members just went above and beyond and I am eternally grateful for them for making our stay so amazing. Now, if you're a mom-to-be and you're looking for a place to have your baby, this is a wonderful place and I want you to hear straight from these other ladies their personal experiences so that you can make up your own decision for yourself. So if you'd like to hear from these two ladies their special stories about having their children there, then just keep watching. And number to me, there's no other reason not to deliver at St. Mary's. Having the team that we have for the women's services as well as the combination with the NICU, in-house physicians at all time, respiratory therapists, neonatologists, obstetricians, it's bar none. Okay, so when our patients come through the door, they're first entered, they come this way and they get visited by our quality medical provider before they're even evaluated. It's a quick stop for our patients. The um, QMP will be able to determine what their needs are, and then they're quickly brought back to our OBED. This is a very, the very first stop and just a really quick, brief visit. So this is one of our labor and delivery rooms that we have. The great part about our labor and delivery rooms is it's all inclusive. So a patient will come in here, they will do their entire labor process in here as well as deliver. Our beds break apart, so there's no changing in and out of beds and they will also stay in here and recover. One of the special things about us is we like to consider ourselves similar to an ICU. We're in contract with the Regional Perinatal Intensive Care Clinic. So a lot of our patients that come through the door are high-risk patients and our staff goes through rigorous training to be able to keep up with those type of emergencies that, that we see. Um, a lot of our patients are, um, they have comorbidities that we're trained to be able to take care of. Things that in a regular um, birth center you wouldn't be capable, you wouldn't have the hands the skill sets to be able to take care of those patients. Knowing that when you're coming into a place that's all inclusive makes delivering so much easier for the patients and their families. I didn't want to leave and I was scared to leave. It was my first baby. Right. Yeah. So I was like, no, we're good. We'll just, we're, what do you mean I have to leave? <laughs> we're comfortable here. And I have nursing you know what, what if it breaks? What do I do? You know what I find is our moms and babies are never apart if possible. That's our ultimate goal. We, we have a level one NICU, no, excuse me, um, nursery if needed, but um, I'd say most of our moms and babies stay together. And especially for first time moms, if the nurse did everything out of sight, did everything for you, would freak out when you, yeah. <laughs> when you go home. So our nurses are with you, with baby, teaching you along the way. And, and you have a lactation consultant. We do, yes, they come. Mm -hmm. And that was, especially mm -hmm. for first time moms, yeah. you're like, I have no idea. When you think back that many years ago, what stands out to you that made it special having your first year in St. Mary's? Oh man, the whole experience was so special. Really, for for me, having the suite made such a difference because I was so rattled. I didn't, I'd never had a baby before, and um, the suite really let like my husband kind of filter the people coming in. The nurses were should be sainted. I mean, they are their nursing staff is beyond. It's amazing. What would you say to somebody who is like pregnant with their first, doesn't know what to do? What would you say to recommend this hospital to them? This is the only one I would even consider because um, I had another experience where my baby had to go to the NICU and we didn't have those um, services available to us. And it was heartbreaking, it was such a mess in your hormonal and to have the peace of mind with my first daughter, she had to have some things checked out and to have to know that they were coming to the room or doing it or that I could come watch them do it in the NICU room was such a different experience instead of like, oh dad, mom you have to stay, you're still a patient. Dad, do you want to get in the ambulance? Do you want to leave mom? Do you want to go with baby? What do you want to do? And I'm like, wait, that's my baby. What do you, what do you mean? So it's, it's the only way to go. 
these two women sharing their birthing stories to me is compelling reasons why you should consider having your baby there. For more information about the hospital, I will have the website in the description box below. As always, thank you so much for being tuned into this video. Hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any future videos that I have coming out. I love you and I will see you in the next video. Bye.